crushed a sinker that just kept carrying in that fourth inning. It doubled the lead with one swing. How quickly did you know that it was going over? Uh, I didn't. Uh, I was just hoping that it was going to go. So um, it's a big ball, ballpark to center. So I was just hoping. It was a sinker left up, and it just seems like this team is not missing when it comes to punishing mistake pitches. What has allowed this lineup, one through nine, to continue to seize those moments? Uh, I think it's just the game plan that the coaches and us have built um, going into this season and continue to evolve. Um, every team's going to pitch us a little bit differently, so trying to pick up that as early as possible and help the next guy coming down the lineup um, kind of report back. So I think that's been, been really good, and the camaraderie has been really good. Aaron Boone said he's like your swings pretty much all year, even in the very beginning, the very first two weeks when the results weren't there. How would you assess where you're at offensively as you continue to platoon with Jose Trevino? Grinding. Uh, just working every day, trying to get better, and uh, just trying to see as many pitches as I can uh, to con continue to improve and help the team win. What you like with how Marcus Stroman was throwing the ball tonight? Unbelievable. He gave us... He gave us length and he allowed us to save our bullpen for this long series um, and you know that's all you can ask for. He was dominant tonight, hit his spots well and pitched out of some good situations so um, to see him out there doing his thing um, it's always fun. It's always a pleasure to be behind the plate for him so um, it was really good for him today. This team's 27 games above 500. Have you ever been on a squad rolling like this right now? <laughs> no. No, it's been a lot of fun and uh, I think we're going to try and keep doing that. Awesome. Congratulations. Thanks for the time. Thank you. Thank you. Back to you guys in the studio.